So after a month of waiting, we have finally gotten the 11th chapter of Boruto, which is the start of the completely original content. I started recording a live reaction. I was interrupted, but only like two pages in. So I'm just going to restart because it doesn't matter. Um, I will once again point out that I hate the ride of new design. I think it looks really stupid. And honestly, I think it's quite disturbing that there. I feel like if there was one thing Kishimoto himself as an artist that I respected, especially in part one, was that his characters were children, and he treated the female characters like they were children. Like, there was never any fan service in part one. There was fan service in part two. Like, literally, like the second arc, there's a bath, there's the a bath. They're the bathhouse thing with Sakura and like the second arc of part two, literally. He was like, okay, she's this thing, it's fine. No, but in part one, they were like 12. He understood that and he wasn't going to like do anything. What Serana is wearing is. <coughs> it's like, I get. It's like, it's like one no 12 year old is like, I'm like. If you look at Sakura as a person, I'm like. I don't think Sakura would ever allow Serrano to dress like that. I just, I just, if you look at, especially, or Sasuke, if you look at them as characters, I found that you compare it to the way Sakura used to dress. It's like, it's like, what the hell is this? Whatever, so step. So yeah, um, okay, I, damn it, aren't, yeah. And that's the situation, did you understand the plan? Damn it, are you listening, Boruto? Hey. Okay, I would like to point something out here. Alright, so there's a problem I've been having. How can Naruto and Hinata not notice the curse mark on Boruto's hand? Naruto's a god and Hinata's a Jonin with the hand of Byakugan. Like, do they think their son got a, a black diamond tattoo on his hand? Like, and you don't think, and you don't think Sakura or Sakura notices the fact that, that Naruto kid is walking around with a seal identical to hers and Zunade's on its hand? You really don't think the Inferian Joni noticed this? You don't think Sakura? I mean, how is Sakura the only one to notice the black cursed seal on the boy's damn hand? Whatever. Yeah, Kumahama said that I heard you loud and clear. You're facing out again. You've been acting kind of strange lately. Are you alright? Sorry about that. I'm fine. And now I only feel weird or anything. And ever since then, I haven't seen him at all. And so now, and ever since then, I haven't seen him at all. And I haven't been paralyzed like back then, since then. Yeah, like back then, since either. That wasn't something as simple as paralysis. It felt a distance. Time itself has stopped. Apart from you, who was he in direct contact with? And 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 me, who was watching with the Renegon. None had any n none had any realization at all to what happened. I'm, I'm not trying to say this to scare you or anything, but what's happened to your body is not normal. You need to be on guard. Especially that seal on the palm of your hand. I'll keep looking into it on my own. But if you feel anything that I strange at all, let me know immediately. Got it. Okay, so it's stun. We know it's stun kind of curve mark. Thinking that, thinking that it isn't gonna do anything. Right now, you focus on the mission. Pursuit is still underway after the three robbers that broke into Konoha Bank. It is advised that all citizens re refrain from leaving that town needlessly. <coughs> Everyone, please, re please, please continue to be on alert. Okay, so a group of rogue, okay, so a group of rogue leech ninjas stole some money. Everything, everything went according to plan. Of course it did. To the Muja, Mujin, Mujin ninjas like us, that was a simple job. All that led to resonating with the boss. What the heck? Okay, so the guy fell. Oh no, Mizuki grabs him. What the hell is that? Forget it. Let's let him go. Ooh! Sir See? Serana's awesome. Serana just rammed that punch into that guy's face, took him out. Okay. Okay, I gotta give this guy credit. The art, I'm feeling it. Like, I'm not, like, with the new characters, I, I can work with this. Guess I got no choice. 
I'll play with you for a bit. <laughs> Zerato is just toying with this guy. Oh my, oh my god, Serana. Ser okay, so, I look right, Serana is a boss. Like, Serana is ripping this guy apart. Like, Serana is definitely nothing like her mother was at her age. Which is, thank god, I mean, I'm a soccer fan, but I mean, this is awesome. This is some, this is some sake level crap right here. My god. Okay, I'm very curious where she learns to fight like that, because that is not the fighting style of either of her parents. Like, it's like, Serana's fighting style is like a strange combination of sake, like, incredible taijutsu prestige and skill, but also, like, Sakura's, I guess you could say you could, like, it, it, it appears to have the same amount of force as Sakura's, like, free... Free range brawler style. It's it's bizarre. But it's awkward to not coordinate her attacks like that. So I'm assuming she learned that from Komahamaru or uh, Sake. I'm assuming because that is Sakura more of like a brawl, like just kind of like a Luffy from One Piece. Like she just hits things. Like she just punches things really hard. But that was like coordinated tiges, like some Lee. So the Mijun. The Mujin Ninja Seed, so that's all you're capable of. You must be confident in your ability. But to compare our boss, to compare to our boss, you're nothing like a little, regular little kid. You, you, you sounded so full of yourself. Sorry to burst your bubble. Um. Okay, this is, this is weird. I love to meet your dog. I wonder if he's my type. Okay, this is weird. Serana's at the meter. I can't tell if her shot and gone that today. The guy needs to do better at making it clear with Serana's shot and gone. <coughs> it's like weird. I'm feeling a little uncomfortable. You're still looking on down on me, you little wench. You want to be our but I'll take you to him. As a course, that is. Oh! Poison. Die. Berta. Not enlighten you at all. Serata. Did you get careless? That isn't like you at all, Serata. Did you get careless? <laughs> I was just trying to introduce some drama to the situation to make it you know, for an exciting climax to our fight. Thanks anyway. I'll fight some tea later. <laughs> I really like, okay, I'll admit, I'm really enjoying this deep Boruto and Serata interaction. It's a really weird, I really like how they're taking the Team 7 dynamic. Like, it's a really weird combination of the relationship to all the members of Team 7 had. Like, you can see some of the Naruto relationship with both Saki and Sakura in there, and it's really, really weird. Damn, there's another one of them. Take on three by myself, they're gonna be tough. Alright, if we. The Serana's also a strategy, apparently. Alright, this, uh, this chapter is like the Serana chapter. Alright, if we turn the situation into a three versus one, we dive in, run away. Everything going according to plan. Now, all we have to do is track him down to where he bosses. Is. <coughs> You're not getting away. Over here. <laughs> Okay! A pair- okay- oh, wait, wait, okay, okay, okay! So, Serana's annoyed, but I would also like- Burrito's an idiot, but can we talk about this man just forward the chat- just forward over a thing- like, like, okay, he- before he could barely form a- like a small mini rock, now he can form one that is relatively big. <coughs> and pretty easily. Rastangan. Rastangan, that freaking moron. Were you listening to the plan at all? What was the point of a pl what was the point of a plan if we're just gonna beat him like that? Like always. <coughs> Sorry about that. So what was the plan? Well, I mean I was listening to the plan or like whatever it was about. We're just going in one ear and out the other. 
Jeez, as they're going on and how you're able to, as they're going on, as they're going on about how you were going to be a support role and all, you still ended up butting in. I guess we get better get going, or we're going to be late for our resignation with with Shikata and the other Boruto. Let me guess, isn't that? Yep, it could end up selling out right away. Hang on, you're planning on running away already? I swear to God, if that come on, bro, what a mess. I guess it's time for kill me, kill me. That come on. Okay, I I I I can't. There was also an interrogation. The ninja tech, the ninja tech division, special special Joni. Chuno Kasuki was a, was a, was apparently under the effect of mind control from somewhere outside the building. What did you say? You were being controlled by someone. You now you mentioned it, Kasu. He was acting rather strangely during the tournament. We already freed him from the mental suggestion that his own mind should be returning to him. But it seems the realization of the truth happened. He's gone through even greater shock. And while he had no idea what what was going on, he was working, he was working and acting in the interest of our enemy. But also, evidence that he was leaking information, concentrating on the ninja test to the enemy. Then, do you think that could have been responsible for Boruto cheating? Is that Eva key? Oh my god! Oh my god! This tired. Oh my! I didn't even realize. <laughs> I didn't even realize that was even key inside. No, they left the only man to take <coughs> a powerful hold on Kasuki. No matter how powerful the suggesting, the suggesting, when spread over ma many people, it gets broken down and becomes weaker. The enemy wouldn't take any unnecessary, any needless risk. We still can't be completely sure, but it's likely that the enemy is after something concerning the ninja tech. Okay, understood. Regardless of what happened, he's still an he's still enabled, a skilled person. I'm sure it'll go through well. I'll leave him in your hands then. That's all. I come to report. True Kamahamaru, the mystery mission stage to infiltrate the village and then successfully beat Boruto and them. They did it! Okay, I feel like I'm supposed to know this girl. Is that Mira? I think that's Mira. Huh, they're not bad. Me yeah. Okay. Okay, so uh, that's Mira. That's Ultima Kid. Holy crap. Mira, you gotta like this in a non smoking area, Shikamaru. Yeah, I know. Anyway, you just said three, didn't you? So their boss. Jojo didn't show up. Corpse, corpse clone Jojo. Yeah, one of the top ten names in the bing, one of the top names in the bingo book. Not only the body to the vo and voices of the people he killed, but though within his memory, he's able to copy them and transform into them. Holy crap! What kind of Keke Genkai does this guy have? We got to hurry and do something about him. Leads and Muji and this mission to us. You got to concentrate all your your attention on today's conference. Ah, oh, the conference. That was today. I love Naruto. I love the Hokage Naruto. That was today. Oh, come on. You have any idea how many times I reminded you about it? <coughs> you got to. <coughs> You got to meet with the Land of Fire Daimo, Daimo here. So don't you say Okay, so for those of you that don't remember, but Daimo is the one who funds the... The village is an independent government state, with the Hokage leading it. And if we're being realistic, the Hokage is the real leader, because, because they're the most... Because they're, like, a, they're the most powerful. Like, they're the most powerful ninja. So the ninjas in the village aren't going to try to fight them. It would be stupid. Like there are like very few ninjas in the village that could take down take down the Hokage. So, but the Dai Mao is the one that funds the village and actually does help in the 
the left kid of the Hokage when the Hokage dies without picking up the Nestor. As in the case of Zunade, he was in a coma. So the feudal lord got to decide who became the Hokage, and he picked Sanzo and Kakashi. Yeah, that's right, okay, I understand. Well, in the situation, no need to worry. Yes? Do take care of that. Gee, what a mess. Who are these guys? Hey, Dad. When I bought that store out earlier, this trade was in it. Oh my god, Naruto has a, Naruto has trading card! That is amazing! It's trading card of Kid Naruto! That is amazing! Oh, that's cool. I didn't have I didn't have this one yet, and I needed this one and started it though. And I don't hurry, I'm going to see later an important conflict of the Hokage. Oh, so this is the feudal lord. It's a different feudal lord. What happened to the old feudal lord? What happened to what happened to that one piece of crap that they donned the Hokage? That guy was an asshole. Did he die? I hope, he I hope so. That guy may don the Hokage. Yes, your lordship. You look after ten ten two. Please do see he taken care of. Understood. Hey, Yamamoka. Yes, your master. How many case, cases does this store have? A, a strange ninja scroll. I beg your pardon, your master, but in this store, each person is limited to only three packs. What? Don't be ridiculous, Yamamoka. They're gonna turn turn down money in front of their faces? Or are they stupid or something? If I can't buy their cases, then... I'll just buy the entire store. Here you go. Tell me 30 Ryu. Alright, here I go. <laughs> that is Hokage. It was a Maki Naruto. Ah, God. <laughs> God damn it. Another, another crap rare. You got a super, you got a super special rare of the ninja of the knight, and that's their crab rare. <coughs> I've already got five of them. What the ass? What the actual hell? This is freaking ridiculous. What are the chance to play just five of the same variety? I got the, I got the second. <laughs> I love the guy. I love how, I love how. Uh, who is, is, that, is that Inojin? I said Inojin. Inojin's like, I got the second. Damn it. I said I wasn't going to spend any more today, but screw it. One more pack of them. Here you go, dumb son. <laughs> Here you go, dumb son. Boruto, you were playing that all your missing rewards? Shut it. You're going at them so hard. What card are you even aiming for anyway? Sasuke. I'm telling you now. When I when I put it out, I'll show you. It's a really rare one. You might even go your whole life without seeing it. I love the boys. Really, they are stupid. They had no idea what's inside, and yet they still spend all their money. What's the fun in that? Actually, I have a strange sensation that Boruto just has some kind of mental issue where he needs to get the Sasuke card. A strange ninja scroll or E. Or E N S as they call it. A super rare card card game a super card game using the history's most famous ninjas as it's seen. All the kids are totally into it. So it's popular so it's popular that even the biggest stores sell out the day they get the sin their Christmas in. So I was like, hmm. You seem to quite know a lot about it. But you don't play, Miki. No, I Hey. Oh, it's just late. What Rock? It's, I love how they call him Lee. So what's your name? So what's your name? Doing with Rock Lee and Metal Lee, or the thing? Right? Was it like Hello Metal? Hello Rock? Hello Metal Rock? <laughs> like what the hell? What's wrong? Coming to deliver a message while training again? Exactly, Boruto. Come on, Boruto. They calling for me? You, me, seriously? Sleep. Can you please not interrupt my post missing relax signs? Hey Boruto, sorry, sorry for calling you so suddenly. Let me introduce you. This is a fuck. This is the son of the land of the die map. May Dokamo Ichinyu. 
Madoko Tenyu, the Dime Mount. Senor Boruto, it's an honor to meet you. This kid, I, I, this kid's the villain. And this kid, I think this kid is the guy in the, in, in the bingo book. I think, the, I think the guy in the bingo book from earlier, Ken, whatever his name was, I'll have to go back and check later. I think he killed the kid, and he, and he now he's taking his place. But then again, Naruto's never been big on killing children. You can just call me Tenya. I'm Uzumaki Boruto. You can just call me Boruto. Pleased to meet you. For being the seventh, the seventh son, you sure do have some shabby clothes. What was that? And what? Oh well, as long as you work hard and get and get the job done, that's no problem. You're pretty skilled, right? Who the hell does this kid think he is? Come on, Bruce and say, just what's going on here? Settle down. Is it also a mission, Bruce? Party starting today. The next few days, you're going to be ten, ten to bodyguard. Bodyguard, this kid. What the, the hell are you talking about? Why me? You could have just asked Dorada. Yeah, Dorada probably would have done it. It's just, I'm pretty, I'm pretty damn certain I'm not going to get along with this kid. <coughs> now, now, don't say that. After all, our land, our, after all, our land, the fire's own dime out. Meiru Iki personally picked you out for this mission. The dime out is going to be staying here in my village while attending a very important conference. And we got to make sure nothing happened to his son during that time. His son. Nick kid is his son. Let me put it this way. As another part of your instruction, I want you to show this... I want you to show just another side of the... I want you to show just another side of some of the crap you got put up with as a ninja. So then, my bodyguard, you mean, have a bodyguard, it really... Have a being a bodyguard, really being a servant. No taste or death at all. There is a cheap. There is a cheap thing. This is my first time having. It. Oh, I can tell I'm not. Okay, I'm not going to like the damn child. I can already tell I will. This is a cheap thing. Hey, Boruto, this is a great chance. How about you, tell me What life is like for your level? I'm really interested. Yeah, yeah. Can we kill this kid? The this kid is a piece of crap. This kid is the kind of person I don't like. Sensei, is, is, is this the part about being, is this part about, is this part being a bodyguard too? Can I suddenly feel real, you like suddenly, really, really, really want to smack the snot out of this kid? Well, there are more hardships you gotta go through, Boto. In the end, you'll just end up learning from this. Stop, seriously, shit. <laughs> Pleased to meet you, Uzumaki Boto. Okay, that was long. Holy crap, that took me 23 minutes to read. I am going to go record my review for this chapter now, and the lion that should be up way later tonight because I don't want to upload too many videos at once. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Like the video if you did, subscribe for more videos. And I may do a video based on this, on the whole Serata thing, I don't know. Hope you guys enjoyed, like the video you did. Comment your thoughts on the chapter down below, or wait for the review to do it, I don't care.